came off a uh, a cassette I had years ago called uh, How Fast Them Trucks Can Go. And the song goes, oh, give me 40 acres just to turn this rig around. It's the easiest way that I've found. Some folks can turn it on a dime or do it right downtown. But I need 40 acres just to turn this rig around. amazing songwriters and singers that I know. So please put your hands together and make my friend Watermelon Slim feel comfortable and at home. All of you, please, give a round of applause for the truck driving king of the blues, Mr. Watermelon Slim. Watch that first step. That's like stepping out of a cab over a truck if you miss that first step. <laughs> I was uh, out in the out in the woods one time, and and the uh, the truck was high centered, which happens when you go over certain logging roads and uh, and cow paths throughout there. And in order to uh, in order to get out of the truck, I actually had to step down further than I thought, so I actually missed that first step and ended up holding on to the door handle for dear life as the rest of my body is underneath the truck. Just, just trying not to, not to fall completely um, uh -huh, over tea kettle underneath that thing. I am a... Uh, a retired truck driver. I, I keep driving a few miles, but uh, my days of uh, commercial hauling have gone in the past. They tell me I'm doing better at this music thing, you know. I figure, I'll tell you what I figure, I figure, I'm not no major leaguer, but I figure I'm making I'm making the living of a double-A minor league ball player. And double-A minor league ball players may not be major league ball players, but they play baseball a heck of a lot better than we play it right here. <laughs> so uh, when people took, when people, uh, when I think about myself being minor league, well, heck, that's at least professional. Raw entertainment. <laughs> you, you get what you paid for, hopefully. But... You don't get you don't get anything you know if you can if you look at me and you confuse me with Justin Timberlake. Not only are you not a responsible uh, critique uh, cri uh, critic of dance, but you better get your uh, glasses checked too. And if you can, you're gonna sing a lot of a lot about diesel and the whine of 22.5 tires. Singing their highway song in the rain. Rolling along like this year. You talking about the about the hill country and the delta and the places that I've been. The traveling life has been tough sometimes, but it's been a blessing to me too because it's allowed me to think about stuff. Mm -hmm. 
Tennessee song, dig it. I was actually rolling through Memphis. I was going past the pyramid and I started to sing a couple of verses of what later turned out to be one of my signature songs. And one driver came back to me after I had finished teeing up the Channel 19 Citizen Band radio to sing this song. And he said, uh, driver, what do you do with that money your mama gave you for singing lessons? Come on. <laughs> and I didn't think much of that, but I let it roll off me like duck off the water's back. And, and 11 years later, I recorded this song. And I just call this the Blue Freightliner. Oh. 